All right, boys. Let's 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 take a look at the chat. I'm enlightened. That's right. I'm enlightened, <laughs> bro. Someone said I look like Andrew Tate. The fuck, the fuck, bro. Hold on. What a handsome man, right? Yeah, that's right. I look charming, bro. That's right, bro. Yo, someone wanna see my head, bro. Should I do like a head review? God damn it, guys. Yo, we are live. We are live, we are in the building! What is up, boys? So, right now, we're gonna get started with the live stream. And you can see there's a shit ton of people joining us right now. <coughs> we in the building. Oh, Alright. So, everyone, before we get started, I want you guys to spam W in the chat. W for the trading gig, let's go. If you have if enjoyed my videos, spam W in the chat. <laughs> Someone said top G. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Let's fucking go boys. Alright, let's let's get started. Now we can get started for real now. Okay, now we can get the, okay we can we can stop the spam, alright? We can stop the spam. Let's get started with the QA. So I wanna do like a little emergency live trading lecture. Like this is like so goddamn last minute. Literally like 30 minutes before this live happened, I was like, you know what? I want to interact with my boys. It's been so long since I communicate with my boys. And we are literally like one of the most fastest. I believe that we are one of the most fastest growing trading YouTuber on YouTube right now. Right, so... Okay, boys, you, you, you guys can stop with the W spam. Alright, so right now, what we're going to do is we're going to do a little bit Q&A, alright? So you guys can just like, let me know if you guys have any questions right now any questions just let me know any questions increase the volume is it too soft let me take a look okay let, let me get let me get my mic set up or some shit bro let me get my mic that's my mic boys let me just set it up so that i can increase the volume Okay, but before you guys ask me a question, give me like a minute so I can set up the mic. Dude, this is so emergency that I literally like did not get the time to set up the proper gear, set up my camera, so I'm just like live streaming from my laptop right now. Okay, I think I need some time to set up the <coughs> the microphone. Some time to set up the microphone. Give me a second, boys. Dude, oh my god, freaking hell. Wait, is everyone okay with like... Are you guys able to hear me? Are you guys able to hear me right now? Is everyone able to hear me? Everyone says there's like a low voice problem. Okay, everyone say they hear me well. Is the mic like very low, guys? Okay, maybe I should get a new mic. Okay, give me guys a give me a little minute. Get a new mic for the boys. Yo! Wait, what the fuck? Are you guys able to hear me now better? Shit, I just realized it's, it's, it's not freaking connected, bro. God damn it. Why am I so dumb? Do 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 do
Okay, now what about now, guys? Are you guys able to see, hear my mic? Are you guys able to hear my mic? Is it better now, guys? Is it better now? Tell me, is it better now? All right, let's get started with the live stream, baby. Let's we can officially get started live stream. Okay. Okay, everyone, one by one, man. Like, dude, like, come on, guys. Like, one, one by one. Ask me serious questions. Serious questions, guys. I can't reply if everyone's asking me. Let me just, like, made it to, like, slow activity or some shit. I can't reply if everybody's, like, so fucking fast. Slow mode. Enter a number. Speak into the mic. Speak into the mic. Okay, boys. Okay, boys. Okay, let's let's get started the Q and A. Number one, which broker you recommend? I I use XM myself, and I think it's only in Singapore or in Asia. All right. So I use XM. <coughs> so so uh, what I used? I determine my stop loss. You're saying I determine my stop loss based on market structure. All right, I base I do it based on market structure. Mm. I'm gonna make the chat thing like a little bit smaller. Make it like right here or some shit. Okay, I'm just gonna get with the Q and A. Which is the best price action trading strategy to use for intraday and what time frame to be used? I've done like a video on what time frame should you be using. You can check out on my YouTube channel. And what price action strategy is the best to use? I would say there is no best trading strategy. Particularly, you have to find out what works for you. Right, that's a very very important point. Like for me, I like the the price action strategy where I look for multiple confluences. Okay, that is one thing. So for me, like I prioritize risk management and trading psychology above strategy. You can have the best strategy in the world, but if you have like a mediocre mindset, you're fucked. So which is the, how many do you trade in a week? I rarely trade nowadays. I've just been so busy with YouTube and business, etc. Oh my God, oh shit. I just realized there's so many questions. Uh oh my god. I'm just I'm just reading through the comments. I don't have a wife, Naira. <coughs> what currency pass do you trade in each session? Right now my favorite currency pass are gold, AUD USD, GP USD. And can you cut intraday trade with small equity amount? Yes you can. Bro, do you do account? No, I don't do copy trading now, that shit. When I'm gonna do live trading, probably soon next month or something where I have more time. Right now, I just don't have the time. So I'm just like getting into like rush, a very rush Q&A. So what books do you suggest reading? 10, 10 Essentials of Forex Trading. That's a very good book for introduction for beginners like i started off reading the book 10 essentials of forex trading and then after i read finished that book that i gradually went to like read books like trading the zone which is more on trading psychology which is very important uh thank you sukesh thank you. yo brisa back say end your live session with a kiss 100 percent. i'm gonna end with a kiss voice so can you do a video on fun my forex funds? Yeah, my forex funds is 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 a good problem. I like it. So have you ever thought about trading crypto? I used to trade I trade crypto like once, I lost money and I never does it again. I lost like I remember like I lost like one hundred dollars because like the story was that I literally bought dogecoin like it was the hype at the point of time and everyone was buying dogecoin right so so i freaking buy dogecoin uh shaleen my my girlfriend shout out to shaleen my girlfriend she said i recommend some books and i just recommended some books and tia bro do you do account management and copy trading no i don't do you are you use chat okay do you use chart patterns do I use chart patterns? Sometimes heads and shoulders, double top, double bottom. Uh, are you in Sentopa? <laughs> no. Best practices to grow $50 account? I would say 
the best practice you can do on growing small trading accounts is to not think about growing small trading accounts. Not think about flipping small trading accounts. A lot of us try to flip small accounts from $50 to $1,000 and we just end up losing money. Focus on trying to like grow it consistently and steadily. Once you can grow it steadily, then that is when you can consider putting more money into your account and then you can start trading like seriously. Let me, just, let me just look at more questions right now. I'm like trying my best to answer all these questions. Uh, okay. Do I do one-on-one -on -one session mentorship? I used to, but right now I don't anymore. I only have my group mentorship right now. Scalping of 5 minutes or 15 minutes, which one is better? I'll say 15 minutes. That's my personality. I prefer scalping of 15 minutes because 5 minutes is quite... It moves quite fast, right? Especially if you're a beginner, you'll get fucked a lot. How to get into my mentorship program? So my mentorship program, I just finished my first lesson with my current batch of students. It was a huge success. A lot of them sent me a message thanking me, saying like they learned a lot from me. So it was really great to hear that. But basically, if you're interested to get into it, I think there's only like a few slots left and the registration ends soon. Like it's either today or tomorrow it ends. So if you want to get into the mentorship program, check out my Instagram. Check out my Instagram. Okay, I show you like this like a post. <coughs> Can we apply what we learn from you YouTube on crypt stocks? Yes. Yes you do. Do do do. I am not going to open any signal page guys. <coughs> Peter Chan asks you earn by YouTube more than trading. That is a very funny question, bro. If you, if I earn more on YouTube then then I am pretty, I'm a pretty shit trader because I earn fucking less on YouTube, man. I do. Yeah, fuck YouTube. Shit. I'm probably gonna get banned for this shit. What session do I prefer to trade? I prefer to trade the London and the New York session. Yes, I'm Chinese. Is it a live mentorship program? Yes, Darren is a live mentorship program. Uh, my skill share has been taken down. Okay, Fenva Code asks, what's my take on the market over the next 12 months? What's happening, right? So, let me give you a story. So, I think like last month or, I don't know, is it last month or last last month? I sold all my stocks. So, it was before the entire stock market collapse. I sold all my stocks. The reason why I sold all my stocks is because I knew dark times are coming. I literally posted like a screenshot, uh, posted like a little note on Instagram to sh Tell you guys to warn you guys about the stock market dark times are coming prepare for dark times because the stock market is going to collapse and one month later it literally collapsed like right now all the stocks are like freaking low right now it just collapsed like crazy yeah so the reason how i predicted is because like i knew that the market was irrational like the stocks were kind of like going up bouncing up a little bit even though the economy was dog shit like I literally sold all my Tesla stock even though I fucking believe in Tesla stock but the economy is just like weighing him down so I had no choice but to sell it so yeah the economy is pretty much fucked Arun PR my Skillshare link is is not working because I got cancelled on Skillshare and right now I've posted my Skillshare course on my YouTube which is the candlestick patterns one and you can check it out on my YouTube Advice for teens trying to balance school and trading. Yo, that's a very good question because I started trading when I was still in school, right? When I was still in school, I started trading. So, I remember like, at the point of time, I was not even interested in studying at all. I fucking hated studying. Like, why the fuck? Like, the education system is just stupid and messed up, right? It doesn't teach me a lot what I need in the real life. So, I would say, you can study. Like, make sure you study during the exam period. But, when you have free time, don't just scroll through TikTok or look at Instagram, look at freaking models on Instagram. Use that free time 
use your weekends to study trading, right? Study every trading, watch trading videos, watch my videos, watch whatever videos you want. Make sure you really make sure you put an effort into trading, right? I'll say that's my advice for you. Yo, Dennis Memba said best Forex YouTuber. Thank you, thank you. I fucking love you, man. <coughs> Shit, man, there's like way too many questions. I, I should have done like a little Q&A on Instagram where I just ask you to like ask me questions because right now it's just like so much questions on my chat right now. Okay, the reason why I don't do sickness is because I firmly, firmly believe that sickness are bullshit. Sickness are a complete waste of time. Sickness are for people who want to get rich fast, right? Everybody want to get rich fast from trading. Everybody want to get six packs fast. But nobody want to put in the work. Nobody want to put in the fucking work. So sickness is just like an easy way out, right? And a lot of times, these signals do not work at all. All these signals, <coughs> all these signals group that you join, sometimes it's not gonna work. <coughs> right? Sometimes it's not gonna work. And there's just no point of buying signals. I just, I'm a firm believer that you have to educate yourself. You have to understand what is going on. If not, when you lose money through signals, you are just gonna be like, what? They just lose money because. Because someone said sell at 1.05, that's stupid as fuck. You have to fucking learn and understand and educate yourself on trading so that you can trade independently so that you don't have to rely on anyone else. No one is coming to save you. Save yourself. Okay, Sanjeev asked what is my real Instagram. My real Instagram is only... The trading gig at the trading gig and at Guangyi at G U N G dot Y I. That's my only Instagram. Other Instagram that is messaging you or Facebook that is messaging you or Telegram that is messaging you is a goddamn scam. All right, it's a goddamn scam. Okay, just don't fucking fuck with them. Send them a a picture of your box or some shit. Naira X say if you reach hundred k subs, what do you, what do you do special? Uh. I don't know, live trading. I don't know. I don't know what to do, honestly. I'll just continue making videos for you guys. Oh my god, Terry said, Hi Brad, how are you? Do you still remember me? I had one-on-one -on -one mentorship with you. Thanks for providing me great knowledge. Yo, what's up Terry? I miss you, bro. I really hope that you are doing well, man. How do you get a psychology right? Someone asked, how do you get a psychology right? I think that's... Uh, that's a very important question. Let's talk a little bit on trading psychology. When you are trading, when you are trading demo account, you won't be feeling anything. You'll be like, uh, this is fake money. I lose 100k, so be it, right? It's just fake money. It's virtual money. It's virtual money. But then once you start putting money into your trading account, once you start trading a live account, that is when your entire <coughs> mentality shift because right now, your hard-earned money is on the line. <coughs> right now, the hard-earned money that you have worked sweating under the sun is on the line. The, or your 9-to-5 job salary is on the line. So, the moment you start seeing price go against you just a tiny bit, you start to feel anxiety. You start to feel like, <gasps> No, this, this trade is not going in my way. And, and, and I'm going to lose that trade. No, my freaking $100. And that is when you need to stop yourself. You need to step yourself, detach from the situation and think of it rational. So my big advice would be to stick to your plan. When you can stick to your plan, it helps to remove emotions from the equation. You won't feel emotional if you follow your plan. Like, I'm not going to tell you that, oh, I'm 100% disciplined and every single time, every single day, I always follow my trading plan because that's not the truth. The truth is that it's still some days where... 
I don't follow my trading plan and I follow my emotions and over trade or revenge trade all the negative trading habits. There is still some days where I do that. So I'm not going to sit here and 100% tell you that I'm 100% disciplined. So my advice, huge advice would be come up with a trading plan, come up with a winning trading plan, follow the trading plan no matter what. This will really help to remove emotions from the equation so that you don't feel those emotions like fear, greed or anxiety, FOMO, all of these emotions, you will feel them because you are human. All of us are humans. We will feel them. What we can do is to feel them but not react to them and try my our best to stay disciplined. So that's my advice for trading psychology. And that is like a million dollar advice. If you can really grasp that, trust me, you're going to become profitable so much faster. Vortex say, first plan, number two, meditation, stop loss. Th stop loss. That's a good ass tip, man. Number one, plan. That's right, trading plan. Number two, meditation. Meditation actually helps, guys. Like for those of you guys who say, oh, meditation is bullshit. Don't meditate. Fuck you, man. Try meditation for one month and let me know if it improves your trading results. I'm pretty sure it's going to improve your trading results. And use a stop loss. Good advice, Vortex. All pals, uh... Can you make a video on trading scam company? I, I don't know what's that. Or oh, trading scam company. I'll say like, I, I don't know, man. Like, I just hate scammers. Just just make sure you, you get familiar with like the company that you are buying the services from. Like, let's say you want to buy a course from this YouTuber. Make sure that you kind of understand like how he's trading and is he really good at ex explaining things? Like, is he like explaining things simple or is it like complicated? All that stuff. So Nathan asked, how long do you take to become consistent? I'll say it takes at least like six months. No, no, not six months. I'll say like you can master trading in six months. Like you can master how to analyze the charts in six months. But for me, I think I took at least one and a half years. One, one, year, one year or one and a half years to become consistent. So I'll say trust the process and just keep going. Because there's no such thing in becoming consistent in one month. If you do that, you are, you are either fucking genius or you are Albert Einstein. Can you make a living with forex trading alone? 100% you can. But if you are broke, you have no money and you go into forex trading thinking you can make money, you are wrong because it takes money to make mo more money in forex trading. So if you are broke, completely broke, get a goddamn job. I don't care if you work at McDonald's. I work at a waiter. I work as a temperature screener. I work at so many shitty jobs. Drenched in sweat, drenched in alcohol, famished, thirsty as fuck. And I make sure... I save up capital to put into my trading and invest into my trading and that got me to where I am today. So make sure if you are broke, go get a job first please. Then you can start having capital, saving up capital and then that is when you can start kind of making a living from trading. <coughs> John Carl asked what, what indicator I use. I only use the moving average. You can see like there's videos of me only using the 8 and 14 moving average. And guys, like right now in the chat, there is so many questions right now. And if you guys have the answers to that question, right, just make sure like you reply to each other, help each other out because that's the point of this tribe, right? I it's very hard for me to reply to every single question in the chat right now because every single second there is one new question. So I'll say if you guys understand like the concepts, like you have the answer to it, just make sure you reply to each other, help each other out. Sakri say, why don't I get funded? Why you hate funding, bro? I have never said I hate funding. Like, I've never ever said, mentioned that I hate funding. Actually, I got funded, right? I got funded, but right now I'm just trading my own capital because there's, like, less restrictions. But I'll say, like, get funded. If you if you need the capital, get funded. I'm, 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 I've never said that I hate funding, all right? I will actually encourage you to get funded because you get access to more capital. <laughs> Mm. 
Jason Tucker asks, I just want to know what time the mentorship program is on in UK time. So the time and the date of the mentorship, it depends every week because we schedule with our students for their flexibility. But most of the time, it's going to be at night, 8 p.m. Singapore time. And it's either on Saturday or Sunday, right? 8 p.m. Singapore time, you can go convert it into UK time. Yo, music addict, addict said fuck indicators made so much money trading with these guys' methods. Thank you, bro. Means a lot to me. Uh, able to repeat what were the two books you recommend earlier? 10 Essentials of Forex Trading and Trading in the Zone. I trade six figures, uh, Giorgio Render. Someone asked me if I sh uh like they a lot of you guys have been asking me like a video on trading plan. I'll probably make like a trading plan video soon. <coughs> Tell them how much you lost for the success. That that trading is not a get rich quick scheme. That's what Agumon nine nine said. Very good point. Trading is not a get rich quick scheme. A lot of you guys think that you can get rich fast in trading. That is what I thought when I caught on the trading. And in my first year, I thought I can become a millionaire in like one month, but we all know that's not the reality. I lost over tens of thousands of dollars. And not just that, I've blown like multiple accounts. I'm talking about like at least 10, 8 accounts. I, 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 don't, even lose, I don't even remember how many accounts I lose. That's how many accounts I lost. i blown. Yeah, so I'll say it's not a garage quick scheme. If you come in with the garage quick mindset, you're going to lose. And you're going to hit a roadblock and you're going to give up, right? And that is just just not the right mentality. So switch to the mentality to think that trading, you are in it for the long run. Like that's when this forever mindset comes into play. What if you are trading forever? If you are trading forever, will you be risking all your money on one trade? No. Because you are trading forever and you need your capital forever. Shohan Mola asks how to watch your videos part to part in sequence. That's a very good video. I mean, that's a very good question. Let's say you just hop onto my channel and you have known no, absolutely nothing about my YouTube channel. My advice for you would be to start watching the full complete trading guides on my YouTube channel, right? Start watching the complete trading guides on my YouTube channel, which I literally give you like a full length guides on support, resistance, all these like beginners guides, like support, resistance, candlesticks, supply and demand zones, Go watch those full trading guides first after you watch finish them and then go to watch the unfiltered trading episodes. I've made like playlists for this on my YouTube channel. So there's a playlist that says full trading guides or complete trading guides for beginners. Go watch that one first. After you watch that one, go watch the unfiltered trading episodes which I talk about how I personally trade, psychology tips, everything. Yo, I wonder if I can share screen with you guys. I really want to share screen with you guys. Can I share screen with you guys? Let me, let me check if I can share screen with you guys. Holy shit. I think I can share screen with you guys. Oh shit, but I have to quit and reopen my slides if I want to share screen with you guys. Uh, God damn it. Okay, maybe like, like, like next time guys. Can't share screen with you guys right now because I have to close and stream and then open up again. <laughs> yes, I, I'm going to be uploading this stream onto YouTube after I end this live stream. It's going to be on YouTube so you guys can rewatch it. <sighs> what strategies I often use bro I only use price action baby that's the only one I use I literally share my strategies I literally share my strategies on unfiltered trading episodes and you can see I just trade price action and sometimes the only indicator I use is the 8 and 14 Oh, someone asked me for my net worth, bro. My net worth is six figures. 
I think like yeah six figures. I'm gonna be making seven figures next year. How much do you make money in this month? That's a very good question. I make a shit. Let's just say I'm comfortable, man. Look at this nice smile on my face. Let's just say I'm comfortable. Okay, the website where I trade Forex is TradingView. All right, go search TradingView on Google Chrome, and then that's when you can find how, how you can analyze the charts, all that stuff. Where do you read the news before doing a trade? Dude, that is a spot on question because like in the next video where I'm going to release, I'm going to talk to you guys about the things that you should look out for before you enter for the trade. And one of it is to check for news and I teach you how to check for news. So make sure you watch that video next. I'm not going to like spoil it right now. Just watch, the, watch that video. What is my previous full-time job before you trade full-time? It was a internship. It was not really a full-time job. It was an internship, a 9-to-5 job at a real estate company. Yeah, so it's like a desk-bound job, like a freaking soy boy. So soy boy desk. Desk. Desk-bound job. What color is T-Bag asks, what color is your Bugatti? Mine is like, non-existent. <laughs> okay, Lucas, why do you trade Forex but not crypto? So for me, I, I talked about my story with crypto. Let me just say it again. So basically, last year, Last year, at the start of this year, is it last year or at the start of this year, there was basically like the hype on crypto, right? You know, the bull market in crypto, everything was going up. Bull coin, uh, not bull coin, Bitcoin, shitcoin, Ethereum, Luna, Dogecoin, everything was going up. At the above time, everything went up to the highest point, right? It went up to the highest point and it starts retracing a little bit. And at the above time, my friend, my dear friend, his name, let's call him Aiken. Okay, no, let's not call him Aiken. Let's call him, like, in case he's watching this, let's call him Ben. Ben, <coughs> fucking Ben, he told me, hey, bro, you know, if you invested in Shiba Inu <coughs> one year ago, you would have become a millionaire. So I was like, oh, wow, I want to become a millionaire. So I went ahead, deposit $100 into Shiba Inu. Freaking Shiba Inu. Guess what did Shiba Inu do? Shiba Inu went down even further after I entered for a buy. Entered for a buy, Shiba Inu went down even further. And you know what's the general advice about investing? Dollar cost average, right? Just save up some of your capital, put it into some freaking stocks or coin, and then buy more. So that's what I did. Price went down, dollar cost average, put in another $100. And then price went down even further, put in another $100. And then price starts going to a few cents. It went from $1... I, I forgot how much was it, 10 cents to like one, a few cents or some shit. I, I can't even remember the price. But basically, price dropped like 100% or 20%, 200% after I ended up for a buy. So I end up just like, what in the actual fuck? I lost $200. $200 on freaking Shiba Inu. So I was like, yeah. I never touched crypto ever again. <laughs> yeah. I never touched crypto ever again. So that's my story on why I trade crypto I mean why I trade forex rather than crypto and I think uh, yeah a big part why I trade forex is because for the crypto market is is all the coins are kind of like correlated with the bitcoin so if bitcoin is going up everything is going to go up also right it, but it's going down everything is going to go down and look at right now bitcoin has just been like consolidating not going anywhere stuck at the 20k to 19k range that is why like is I will be in I'll be like interested in investing in crypto but just not anytime soon until price showed me that it's gonna go back up. <coughs> why, is, bro? The the slow drop. Ask why do the older generation struggle so much in trading? Uh, because they are boomers and they don't know how to use computer. <coughs> uh, fuck my cough, man. Yo, I, I'm reading like literally all the comments and I see that like a lot of you guys thanking me for my videos and I really appreciate all the thanks because like 
all these comments like really motivated me. I remember I had like 1,000 subscribers like at the start of this year or some shit, 1,000 subscribers. And then last month, I had like 3,000 subscribers or something and my channel just has been exploding because I know I make goddamn good con content that deserve like more views. So thank you for watching my videos and I'm very happy that my videos have helped you guys out. I'm very happy that you guys learned something from my YouTube videos. <coughs> thank you, Danny. Do you always have the scalp go? No, you don't have to always scalp go. Sometimes I like to swing trade go, I hold it a little bit longer. Do -do 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 -do. Sakri said, do you get funded or flip your hard cash money? I actually did both. I tried to flip small accounts and I also get funded. I've been in the both extreme end of the spectrum and I'll say that getting funded is much more better like it helps you to become a better trader because you actually get stick to your risk management rather than try to flip small accounts <clears throat> yo thank you to anyone who say that get well soon bro and romario said press the like button guys that is goddamn right press the like button smash the like button <clears throat> uh sodium said dream location vacations i'll say i i went on thailand thailand was pretty pang i love thailand uh, I'll say next next place I wanna go is Bali, but I will probably wanna go when I have the time to. Yeah, so yeah, I wanna go Bali. <coughs> Booming Forex says, when will you be releasing online course? That's a very good video. I will love to release the online course right now, but right now I have finished the beginner traders course, right? So for those people who are completely new to big to trading and they want to get started with only like one hundred dollars, invest into the course only for I think one hundred or two hundred dollars, I forget the price, <coughs> and you can get started with trading. That's the beginner's course. But I think most of you guys here are more interested in the intermediate and advanced course where I talk about how I trade and all the trading strategies, all that stuff. And I haven't get started with recording that yet. So I think that will be like next year. Yeah, next year or even at the end of this year, right? That's the soonest. But I think most of the time, it's going to be next year. So, yeah, online course will be coming out next year. This channel is life-changing. Thanks, Ida. Keep it, Ida. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Give me new side. Thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. Uh, Bendy asked, are you trading on FTMO? I'm not trading on FTMO right now. Like, uh, I am just trading my own money right now. Someone said, I'll be at 500k subs soon. Congrats on the growth, bro. You'll be at 500k in no time. Thank you, Tai VL. I appreciate it, bro. <laughs> Come to Croatia. Dude, I would love to go to Croatia, bro. And I would love to go to Italy also. Who's the one that said Italy? Uh... L4RS91. Bro, if you come to Italy, I offer you a drink. For sure, bro. I'm looking forward to it. Ali Toma asked, do you have any other passive income? Yes, I do. Like, I have other passive incomes. Okay. I want to touch on having income streams outside of trading. It is a very, very important thing, right? You must understand that you cannot just rely on trading as your sole income unless you have a profitable, consistent track record or you are trading with pop firm or a large amount of capital. Because if you are just like flipping small accounts, which is, and you're not inconsistent, how are you going to put food on the table when you have a bad month? So I will emphasize the importance of having other income streams other than trading other income streams that actually generate you money consistently. <coughs> like, once you have other income streams, it helps with your trading also because it removes the psychology of, oh my god, I have to make money from trading. If not, I'm not gonna be able to put food on the table. That mentality causes you to lose a lot of money. So, by having other income streams, by making money somewhere else other than trading, it removes that feeling that, naughty as feeling and then you will feel like you'll feel more locked in when you are trading so make sure you have other income streams don't just trade with your last $100 I did that and I freaking hated it because I always end up losing that $100 because I was like this is my last $100 in my bank account and if I don't make money I'm gonna be fucked I can't buy lunch and yeah never, I'm never gonna do that again make sure you have other income streams 
Jason Takas, do you do an advanced course? Yes. Uh, right now, I, I think next, we actually like next month, I mean, no, next, not next month, next year, I'll have a advanced intermediate and a beginner's course. Everything's going to go out next month. Everybody, everything's going to be launched. Ape X said you are making us billionaire. Do I fucking appreciate it, man? I I hope that all of you guys inside the tribe, especially my tribe members, go to freaking get to become a millionaire. That'd be fucking sick, man. Yo, I appreciate you guys giving me tips to like help me soothe the cough, like warm honey lemon. I appreciate you guys so much, man. Thank you for. Thank you for your your caring and your tips. I love you guys. And a lot of people say like my, my videos are motivational. And I'll say that like a lot of people relate more to my struggles than my success. Like as a human, you will always relate more to struggles because I'll say like 90% of the population is dealing with some shit, right? Be it financially, mentally physically they are all dealing with some shit right and i'll say all of this the stories that i share with you guys on my youtube channel is my own experience with trading is my own story and i, I just i'm just so want to like share with you guys that like <coughs> for me like i freaking if i can came from nothing and actually build something to myself you guys can too like you guys can too so I don't mean for my stuff to be motivational. I just mean for my stuff to make you guys like relate to my story to show you guys that if a stupid ass guy like me can make it, you can make it also. <sighs> drink a beer. Toby said drink a beer. Yo, I love you guys, my Philippines fans. Yes, I have plans to visit the Philippines. Bro, I've been applying your lessons by crypto trading and it instantly works like a read charts pretty well now. Thank you, Jonah. Keep on going, bro. I believe in you, brother. Keep going. <laughs> Danny Cruz said a, a tequila shot and lemon. <laughs> Appreciate you guys, man. I appreciate you guys. How work we tell and say my family keep telling me to stop trading, but I won't. Keep going, bro. I believe in you. Your family might not believe in you. I believe in you, bro. A lot of people say that I've I've learned they have learned more from my YouTube channel in a few days than those other ones in years. Thank you. Thank you, Josh. I'm I'm very I'm really glad to hear that, bro. Okay guys. How long have I been streaming for? Yo, like, I really hope that I've answered, like, your questions. If I have still haven't answered your questions, make sure you just ask it in the comments right now, and I'll try to answer it. Do I trade SMC? Uh, I trade more of price action, but I'm fluent with... I kind of have, like, understand SMC. But right now, I'm just sticking to price action, which is simple and what works for me. I'm drinking water, bro. Sparkling water. Sparkling water. Because I'm not a brokey. 
No, no, I'm just kidding. I'm just drinking good old plain water. Why am I wearing hood anytime? Someone asked me what, <coughs> why am I wearing hoodie anytime? Can you guys answer in the chat? Like, why am I wearing hoodie anytime? Every time. Someone go answer in the chat. An answer my boy Naira X. Why am I hoodie wearing hoodie anytime? Every time. Lee Daniel said that that's a trademark. Lee Daniel, con congratulations, you got it right. That is the reason why, like, I wear a hoodie anytime. Is because like, even when I have hair, I, I still wear a hoodie. It's because like, I want you guys to recognize, to recognize that this is my brand. I want you guys to recognize that this is who the trading gig is. Is a guy who just wears a hoodie, and he makes a, sh a more money than you. That's just it, bro. Okay, nah, nah, I'm just kidding. It's, it's, it's just like, it's just my, my brand, right? It's my brand. And you, you guys see like all my thumbnails, like I'm wearing a hoodie, then you guys can recognize me that, oh my God, it's, it's the trading gig. And, and I'm just trying to be unique, man. I'm just trying to be unique. Right here. Holy shit! Yo, what's going on, day trading addict? What's going on, bro? Bro, you know, like, that's one of the scalping video. I literally got it from inspired from the day trading addict. And it's in this, like, freaking chat right now. Yo, I appreciate you, day trading addict. Welcome. Welcome to the tribe, bro. Yo, I'm, I'm definitely gonna, like, change my channel picture soon. My Instagram is at the trading gig and at gung.yi. <coughs> Show more unfiltered videos on my YouTube, my my journey, my journey. Yeah, yeah, like there's gonna be more like unfiltered trading episodes on my. There's gonna be more unfiltered trading episodes every week. Like my schedule is every week I release uh unfiltered trading episodes where I share about like my journey and stuff. Dude, damn. Yo, thank you, Alex Trading Tips. I love your content too, man. Your content is amazing also. I'm no longer on vacation. Actually, I'm kind of like still on vacation, but right now I'm like more locked in and stuff. Do -do 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 -do. <coughs> okay, I want to take some time to like address like the mandatory program. You guys must understand that this is not a course. This is not an online course, right? It's not an online course. So it's a premium mentorship program. And what does a premium mentorship program mean? It means that it's literally me coaching you over a Zoom course. It's not freaking course where I just send you some videos and you don't get to ask me questions. It's literally a premium mentorship program. So that's why. That's why like the price, right? That's why the price. <coughs> Yo, the tribe is big, yeah. Yeah, bro, the trap is big. Cameron said no more brokies. That's right. My my goal on this channel is to make everyone not brokey anymore. No more brokies, guys. Come on, no more brokies mentality in here. Stop being a bitch. Doo -doo 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 -doo. 
Six uh eighty two said that what's a good day to find entries as I'm always feeling insecure and scared to get in. I'll say like a good way to find entries is that you cannot be entering when price is in the middle of nowhere. You want to wait for price to get to a level, a key level. Then look at what price is doing right there. Any candlestick patterns that is being formed right there. Then that is when you can enter for a trade, right? So make sure you just like. Be patient. Wait for the perfect trade setups to be formed, and then that is when you can enter for the trade. <coughs> Yo, actually, like, like, I want to like freaking give you guys like a little speech. I think there was this video. There, there was there was this video that I did. There is there was like I talk about how I was gonna like dominate the trading industry on YouTube and I talk about how I I'm gonna become like one of the fastest growing YouTube channels about trading in Singapore. At that point of time I have one thousand subscribers. It was like last year. I remember I, I literally did this video. I was walking in the park and then I had one thousand subscribers back then and I thought that I was the shit, right? I thought that was the shit. I was, I was like, yo, you know what? I I'm 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 like one of the best traders in Singapore right now, which is my country. <coughs> and the story is like I, I've always visualized, I've I've always think that I'm the best. I've always never give up. Even when I had like one hundred views on each video, I've never give up. I kept pushing. I, I kept figuring out like what works and what doesn't work. And I kept on pushing. And suddenly I started getting 2,000 subscribers. Like I, I had 2,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. But then I every single day for six months straight, every single day, I set a goal at the start of this year. I set a goal that I'm gonna reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year at least. Right. At first I I, I said that I wanted to get hundred thousand, but I was like hundred thousand subscribers is kinda unrealistic, so I said ten thousand. I was having like small dick energy, small dick goals, right? But then right now, dude, 100,000 is really quite realistic right now. So, so I was like, yeah, I've always thought that I'm the best. I'm the best in the game right now. And I continue every single day. I visualize, I visualize what it will feel, what it will look like to reach 10,000 subscribers. It was a lot of visualization. After I visualize, I put in the work, record videos, even when I don't feel like it freaking record videos when I don't feel like it because I knew that my purpose, my mission is to simplify trading and make more people consistently profitable traders. That was always my goal on my YouTube channel. <coughs> if you go onto my YouTube channel, right, you will see like my my banner, my, my YouTube channel banner is literally says that my mission is to simplify trading and inspire our generation of young men and women to become profitable traders who are more focused on psychology and risk management. And that is... That is why, like... Like, the point of this story is to show you guys that, like... It's not just visualization. You have to actually put in the work. Like, you actually have to be disciplined and do, like, the hard work, especially when you don't feel like it. It's like the same thing with trading. I started like thinking that okay I'm gonna make hundred dollars per month and then I move on to start trading making one thousand dollars per month and then eventually making ten thousand dollars per month. So set big goals, visualize and then just put in the work and I was, I'm I'm fucking hundred percent sure that you're gonna get there. Because the moment you start giving up, right? That is when <coughs> you lose like <coughs> Oh my god, sorry. The reason why, the reason you start giving up, that is when you know for sure, 100%, you're gonna lose. You're gonna lose. You're gonna, if you quit right now, you will lose. There is 0% chance that you're gonna make it. But if you push on, you keep going, there is at least a 1% chance that you're gonna make it. At least 0.01% chance you're gonna make it. But if you quit right now, guess what? You will not make it. 
So I hope that this serves like a little motivation to you guys. To tell you guys to keep on going, bro. I believe in you guys. I learned my forex from I, I bought like this YouTuber's online course. Yeah, that, that's when that's when I, I bought Forex. Yo, Terry said, Hi Brad, it's amazing how fast your YouTube channel grows. I still remember that you only had 700 subscribers less than one year ago. Keep on, keep going, the, go, keep doing the good work, bro. Yo, yeah, that, that, that's crazy. Literally had one freaking 700 subscribers a year ago. It, like, it's, it's just crazy how time flies. 700 subscribers. I'm gonna pin that comment. Keep the fire burning. Thank you, Jay. Let's go. Let's fucking go, boys. Let's fucking go. We got this, boys. We got this. Alright guys. How long have I been streaming for? Shit, I've been streaming for one hour. Alright guys, that's like uh, all the time that I have right now. Any last questions for me before I leave? Last questions guys, just say any last questions that you have right now before I leave. And yes, this live stream is gonna be up on YouTube. After I end the stream right now, it's gonna be up on YouTube. So yeah, don't worry about that guys. Thank you, thank you guys man. Like it's really always it's always good to see you guys like giving me like positive comments, telling me that I've changing your life. Like it's really like motivational. How long it took me to become consistent? I'll say it took me like one and a half years. Brokies become kings when you join the tribe. That's right, Emmanuel. That's right. How many languages you can speak? I only like three, bro. I can only speak three languages. No, uh, I never went to university. I never go to university and I went to polytechnic. What is my secret? My secret, the truth, my secret is just a lot of hard work and a lot of like perseverance. That's just the truth, man. I appreciate you guys, man. I appreciate you guys. Lover, lover, I, I've really learned a lot for you. Keep up the good work, bro. Thank you guys, man. Thank you guys. I freaking appreciate all of you guys right now. I appreciate all of you guys. Oh my god. How <coughs> what I think about market manipulation, I'll say like market manipulation is very much real, right? The big boys, as long as they have the power to do whatever the fuck they want, they're gonna do whatever the fuck they want. If you have the money to do whatever you want, you're gonna do whatever you want to manipulate the market or so. I'll say it's, it's, it's fucking real. One day if I'm... <laughs> one day if I become a successful trader, I'll take you for a vacation here in the Philippines for free. Thank you, Switch2. I'm looking forward to that day. Javier said, will you take Disciple? Um, I... I don't know, man. Like, I don't know if I should take Disciple. But I just have a mentorship program right now. And all of my students right now are kind of like my Disciples. What leverage do I advise you to use? I'll say, 1 is to 100 is good enough. 1 is to 100 is good enough. How much did you start trading? I started with $500 and <coughs> Yo, Ocean, like I, I made videos on trading with small accounts Like you can just check out my YouTube channel 
Ali Ali said, I want to start trade thing, start things trading. I'll say join my Discord. I literally give you like a beginner's, I mean a guide to trading for beginners. So join my Discord. It will definitely help you guys out. I literally show you like a step-by-step -step guide, like what videos should you watch on my YouTube channel to become like a profitable trader. Emmanuel, let's go, bro. Ram Ali said, yesterday I took 200 to 3,400 just because of your YouTube mentorship. Wow, that is, that is a... Good job, bro. I freaking appreciate you, man. Keep going. You got this, bro. No, I don't do binary options. Freedom Flame, Anu, Anbu. Any advice on stage 2? Yao Sam Tai. Stage 2 is the losing stage, if I'm not wrong. I'll say... Losing stage is the freaking horrible stage to be in, man. Like, like, it sucks to be in the losing stage. I'll say... Now, your focus should not be making money. Your focus should be breaking even. Once you start breaking even, how do you break even? You stay disciplined, stick to your plan. <coughs> Read up more on trading psychology. Watch my unfiltered trading episodes. They will definitely help you to get out of the stage too. All right. Yeah, like uh, Sukesh said, everyone just hop into Discord. We will help you out there, 100%. Everyone join the Discord server and everybody help each other out in the trading tribe and it's just a really good thing to see. Uh, the link to Discord is on my YouTube channel. Just click on any video and click the see the link in the description and you can see the Discord. Or you can just go onto my YouTube channel and just click the Discord. <coughs> okay, you know what? I'm just gonna like do the honors and just send you guys a link right here uh, to join the discord server give me a second guys uh i i just really want to make sure that everyone get into my tribe everyone must get to my tribe seven days never so there's a link in the discord server in the chat right now click on that link if you still have not joined our discord server you are missing out because there's a lot of people helping each other out and just like keeping each other accountable and giving each other guidance all right so click on the link to join the discord right now <coughs> profitable tribe let's go baby let's go let's go all right guys i'm gonna end right here okay so um, I'm glad that you guys have enjoyed the dream. I mean, I hope that you guys have enjoyed the live stream. I'm so sorry if I did not get a chance to answer all your questions because there's literally a lot of questions every single second. So make sure that you keep going and keep pushing and like this live stream if this video has helped you guys out. And yeah, like, appreciate you guys for watching my videos and helping this youtube channel grow so fast like it's just crazy it's just it's just really crazy to think about it and i appreciate you guys and i want to give back as much as possible so there's gonna be new videos coming out there's a unfiltered trading episode coming out next week this vid this week there's only one video and because i want to do one live stream and one video which is this live stream that you can see right now next week there's gonna be i don't know do two to three videos so you can just like stay and wait for that all right so yeah thank you guys and remember, you are just one trade away. Good night, boys.